Hi, my name is Ruth Cheesley and my pronouns are she, her. I work full time for Acquia as project lead for the Mortic Open Source Project. I'm really passionate about open source. It's been a huge part of my life and it's something that I really believe in. If you want to make a change in the world, there's lots of different ways you can do that, but I believe that open source is one of the more accessible ways to really influence change, whatever your life experience or your skills. I first came across open source as a broke student looking for antivirus software and tools to help me with learning with absolutely no idea what open source actually meant other than it being something that didn't cost me anything to use. And over the last decade, I've been involved with several open source projects and currently lead the world's first open source marketing automation project, Mautic. In every project I've volunteered with or worked with, real change has been made in the world. Real change has also been made in my world as I moved from a career in healthcare to a career in technology. So whether it's content management system that helps people develop a career and a livelihood, maybe even building a business, employing others, or having access to designs and the know-how to be able to create your own house, or maybe even the resources that you need to build a system that will automatically water your plants based on what the weather's doing. Open source opens doors and it changes lives. It makes things possible for people and organisations which they just couldn't have done by themselves. It's through open source that some of the biggest challenges facing our planet are being tackled collaboratively, transparently and openly. The beauty to me of open source is that it allows you to access the resources, but also most open source projects have an amazing community of people who are really passionate about helping others to succeed with that tool. More and more, there are multiple ways for you to get involved with the projects you use, to be a part of something, to be a part of the solution and to give back in whatever way you can, big or small, to the individuals, to the organisations that make that open source resource. And by extension, you're giving back something to the wider world. When I started out, I didn't think I had anything to contribute. I wasn't a developer, I didn't write code. So what was there that I could give to these projects? It didn't really even enter my mind until I started to get to know the people behind the project and all the different things that need to happen for an open source project to be successful that I came to realise I could make a difference just as I am. My journey to contributing to open source was definitely through a non-traditional route. I trained in sports science and later qualified as a physiotherapist, but I'd always been a bit of a closet geek and I was always tinkering away with something. And while I was looking for a physio job, I ended up in IT and a temporary job in a school who asked me to build a website. And I came across some open source tools and I ended up using Joomla. And then outside of work, people heard I was building websites and eventually I started getting paid for doing it. Over time, I got better, I branched out into more complex projects, started needing to connect with other people using the software so I could learn from them and bounce ideas off of them. But there wasn't any group near me. So my first contribution was starting a user group. It was my first attempt to help give something back to open source. Later, as I got more deeply ingrained into search engine optimization for those websites I was building, I saw lots of areas in the software that could be improved to help that. I'm not a developer, I didn't have the skills to make those changes, so I started speaking at conferences about what could be improved, explaining how we could do this to make it better for those websites and help them appear higher in search engines. And after a while, I found developers who wanted to work on that with me. And we ended up contributing several features to the core and also supporting a Google Summer of Code project. So those features are still in the software now. People are using them all over the world to improve their SEO. And later I got involved in uh, setting up a working group to improve the marketing of the software. I joined the community leadership team to help user groups and marketing. And I ended up speaking at lots of events all over the world about the project. I've contributed to lots of open source projects in different ways, from fixing typos in documentation, to helping test and fix bugs, improving their marketing strategy and loads more. So if you're a developer, it's often obvious how you can help make a difference, but if you're not, or if you're still learning to be a developer, there's loads of ways that you can give something back if you've got that interest. You might think your contribution is small in the big picture, but with many people making small contributions, and some people and organisations making big contributions, amazing things happen. Because ultimately, together, we can go much further, much faster. So the next time you notice something not quite right, or you find a bug in some software, or you do something really awesome with an open source resource, think about contributing back. Have a go, submit the bug fix, fix a bug. Write up an article for a knowledge base, be a part of the solution, be a part of making the world a better place. 
Open source lets you do that. And it's a great way to work with incredibly passionate people all over the world at the top of their game on something that you all care about. So what more could you want? Just get started today.